also recommend not using the M1 Desert from RHS. Oh yeah, the thing that we're all touching. That, that makes sense. <laughs> Oh, just say not you don't use the M1 Hi, Zon, 5-0. Oh, yeah, sick. Are you around? Can I yeah, what? Can I first from the MP5 to show why it's so awesome? Yeah, so for the record, guys, uh, there's no bad guys around here, so if you want to go test weapons, feel free. Just don't shoot your Vix, because I'm not repairing them, but you could probably repair them yourself. Outside the hangar, please. Have some decency. This is Alpha 50. Good check. Bravo, checking in. Just because they were shooting out there, if they really want to. Delta checking in. Do that, otherwise we'll uh, wait how things go. Where are you? Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. All right. How are you guys doing? Radio check. I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. Good check. Let's, uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? And we got people still joining. I've got plenty of things made. I got a debug zone over here because I want to make my convoys in Zeus because that'll be easier for myself. And that should be a okay. Uh, yeah, sure. Hey, so person that wanted to check for explosives on mine detectors, I put four inert IEDs out there. I'll delete them when we start. Work. 
still can't believe I gave some of them M1 Garands and they're actually using them freaking shads. Nice to have some targets here. I'm letting them play around with the arsenals. These are uh, similar arsenals to what we had last Sunday, but I made a few changes, made some more deserty things, except I forgot to do the backpacks deserty, so oh well, little oversight on my end. And this gives them a ground to actually play with uh, some of the guys. That's a Lancer clip, eh? I have to say, that would actually be really cool if it would make all the bullets disappear as it was used. That's a Saga 12. You just destroyed the target outright. Wow. Heck. Yeah, I know, they're, they're shooting the bottoms of the targets, and that's what's causing it to uh, break. Hey, someone want to let them know the guy with the Saga 12, his shots are so powerful that they're actually, like, destroying the targets. <laughs> Bravo to Force. Um, I'm thinking of taking my guys as a recon element to find our caches and lock that down. Alpha copies. We're probably going to take an SPG-9 and uh, a technical alert too. The thing is, they don't have scope, so they got to kind of shorten their range here. I don't, we don't have a medicaid, I don't believe. Why what? Who needs slug? So we'll see how things are going. How are you guys doing? I'm not sure if I put an end field in the arsenal. Let me check. I don't think I did. I think I only put the Garand in here, but it's just a lot of fun guns that we have, like NI armed stuff, some TSB assets. Uh, leadership, do you want to meet by the C-130 to have a conversation of what we're doing? Just a big mix of gear. Um, sure. Or whatever they feel like. And then the pistols are mostly DSB assets as well. Then, then AT, short range for everybody. AT, guys, AT. Helmets, uniform. The vests have changed. I forgot to change the backpacks, so but that's okay. And then, you know, all their standard other gear. Oh, he's talking to fucking Bavarian. God damn. And then these are all loadable via ace, so... Really simple. Uh, they're looking for these three types of textures. They're gonna come in through convoys, which I'll make dynamically, as well as they're on some hard points. Except these guys don't know how to patrol properly, so... Whatever. We got a mix of Red 4 guys are your um, Islamic State militias, so they're a little better equipped. Uh, and the green four guys are Takistani tribals, and except for this position, which is just meant to be like a dud position of fully armored to the teeth, blah blah blah. Um, they've got small positions here and throughout, so we'll be having convoys through both. It's supposed to be a serious mission, it's just we're playing around with a lot of different stuff. There's um, There's an overarching campaign to this. If it was a meme mission, I'd add guns like the potato launcher from Glob Mob and stuff. Uh, so we're not gonna be able to. No, I am. I was lucky to get a bag. They're supposed to be PMC based, which is why there's that heavy weapon Jesus. variation here. And then we've also got two technicals with 14.5 millimeter KPT, two SPG 9s. Uh, we had three transport trucks. I don't Okay, one got driven back here, that's why. And then two recovery vehicles for getting the gear back. They gotta unload it, bring it to, uh, 
or load it, bring it to this, and then this can fit 18 of them, and more than that. Well, we also have a C130, and they'll be a okay. Um, that doesn't have a parachute. So yeah, no, it doesn't. So, um, I would love to actually. I wonder if we would alter that with. Havoc, to answer your question, if you read the task, it says that that C-130 is supposed to be loaded with cargo. It's not for infantry transport. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm aware. That was Iceberg. Okay. I, I am aware of that as well. What did we do oh, anyway? I don't know. It's not like you I am maiming. Slightly. Fucking server. Uh, no, that's not going to be... Is this an example of what the cargo will look like, or do you have an... Or is it just... It'll, it'll be noticeable. The example's at spawn. I mean, it, I thought it said it in the task, I guess not. I read it, but I didn't see that part about it. Okay, yeah, no. that's what I thought it was. It's a pallet of bricks, four fuel yep. barrels, and the yellow thing. What are we doing, playing modern day Catan? Um, <laughs> I'll trade you two bricks for a wheat. <laughs> Nah, I'm going endgame, man. I need the stones and the wheat, man. But I'm going for longest road. Fuck longest road. Biggest army's better. Let you control the thief, man. <laughs> True. Ah, uh, classic mine is bigger than yours. They're not allowed to use the C-130 though, so this is, um, I, I don't have a way to show it dynamically, but 18 of those pallets can fit back here, and then 6 of the pallets can fit up here, but again, it won't show because I don't have a script that'll do that, and I didn't feel like making one because that would have taken hours, and those hours could have been spent prepping for school, or working on uploads, or other mission files, and that shit, so... Nine, <laughs> yeah, Settler's Catan is a great game. I should have more board game nights with some friends. Oh, wait, that would require me to have friends. <laughs> anyway! Uh, I'm gonna start building a convoy. What? Let's see, I'll have a green four convoy first. Let's, um... Let's do four bricks. Oh, great. Now I'm gonna speak as if this was Catan. Great. So, four things of bricks. We're gonna get a recovery, Vic. Uh, actually, we'll do three and get an open top Ural. So if I were to go into Takistani tribal fighters here, go to cars, I might have to go into trucks actually. They don't have a truck section, all right. All right, Ural open. You know, the issue actually, I only tested them with recovery, Vic, so we'll do recovery. Recovery. Copy. Because you want them on the edge so players can walk up and get them uh, set up with um, uh, cargo. Charlie's ready to go Alpha. Alpha's ready to sell. So let's see, this is just going to be a simple convoy. We're going to have it Steve led with a alpha. BRDM. Yep. And let's do a uh, Dishka in the middle. Simple convoy. We'll have it a column formation. We're going up north and we're going to do some reconnaissance. Oops, sorry. Reconnaissance and find out what's going on. Let's see. Oh, Close. Let's take a group of tribal fighters here. 
go this with is that. Uh, 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 just a quickie. What's every spot doing again? Just to uh, make sure. Section again. And Charlie's going with Alpha down south. Uh, Bravo is currently traveling. Hey, I'm gonna put these guys in the careless uh, on fire. The northern towns and get eyes on what we can. Um, I recommend at some point after you guys do your initial clear of the town, uh, start doing some route clearing um, on the northern road uh, to make sure there's no IEDs and we can move our vehicles without being molested too much. Alpha copies. Send in GOAT Team 6 now. Thanks for all the great tops this year. And let's see, let's have uh, this group. Come along this MSR. And if they miss a convoy, I can just reuse it, which is fine. But that'll at least, um, you know, put them in the AO, so they'll use it. Because I think no one's using the helicopter, which is a very critical part of this mission. So, otherwise, it's just going to be left to a lot of guessing. Apparently, Echo does not have an engineer, but we have our feet, so we can just check IDs or something like that. Uh, we'll go check the... All right, otherwise, road. Michelangelo, thanks for the three-month resub. I all, hope you, you have enjoyed the operations, use, both watching way. and playing, if you've played any. And I hope you get a kick out of uh, today's operation. I, I'm right, trying so to push to um, some like unique concepts because I've I've played so many attack ops, some defense ops. Though admittedly, last night's cherry defense op was one of the best I've played in a while. I wish there was a little more AI to fight, but Delta, if you want to move I mean the frames can, for Georgetown um, with what he did to that town were south, pretty much perfect. Um, and then we'll use Alpha. Like I'm gonna ask him if I could like Charlie use that AO because uh, I'd love to adapt a defense mission support. out of it. But, you know, I'm, there's so many ops I've done where it's just go here, um, patrol, attack, blah, blah, you, uh, you know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to change it up a little bit. And use your binoculars just and to, other things to make things a bit more interesting, make it more unique. Market as you can, um, act as a secondary recon force. Hey, firm. And this was originally meant to just be like pure convoy raiding. But then I thought, what if the players don't take the Probably helicopter? And so as I predicted the, that to be right, you want to divide up the town <laughs> and then we can each take a side. Um, I put um, some hard yeah, points sure. in here as Alpha well. Alpha will take the western side of the MSR. Otherwise, how are you all doing? Roger. I know I already asked that, I just forgot to read. But otherwise, players have also been asking for some more complex operations, so I'm trying to give them those more complex operations here. Also, I gotta make sure, um... My one issue with these is there are some IEDs. Uh, I would leave it optional if I wanted to use them or not. But I am going to demine this one. Because it was all about, like, depending on where they went, because if you noticed, I put the convoy in a route that the players are going to be, because what's the point of putting a convoy through an AO if um, it's not going to be seen? So we got an entire squad up here doing recon, which confuses me because they have a helicopter with a camera. I don't know. The players are weird. I'm doing more like open stuff to let them kind of have the choice, hoping that, you know, eventually they'll make more and more decisions that'll make them better players like we did it in the old days like years ago, but... Some of their choices are really weird. No squads left, and for my second op, I ain't going solo. Beer, you could always... If you know how to fly a helicopter, you could always join up on a different squad. I don't think the server's full. Are you asking me something? Yeah. Can I get a TP once uh, Delta reaches its destination? Um, I can just TP you to the car, so. No. Yeah, so that car is full, that's why I teleported next to it, so. 
if they don't think about the logistics of having a team of six, then there's nothing I can really do for them. How's that convoy coming? It'll probably get that cleared, and then the convoy will show up. We'll see how things go. And there's first contact. Stone! Well, Willow, I appreciate it, my man. I hope you keep enjoying things. And I hope you keep learning, because there's a lot to learn in this game, to say the least. Just doing some blind suppression up there. Uh, so I'm pulling that away from the fuel station because I don't want it to uh, blow up. Because that might blow up the actual fuel station and stuff. So I'm going to have these guys restand up because I want them in those overwatch positions. we got a lot of guys that are prone at the uh, moment. And I'm going to start setting up another convoy. So let's get another recovery Vic here. We're going to do the tribal fighters. I'm going to grab these four thingamajigs. And let's quickly get our attachments here. Alpha to Charlie, um, we found crates at the fuel station. Try not to use explosives in that area, please. Thank you. And I want to put this on a dirt a, road uh, up here. Uh, crates that we need to capture. Absolutely. And let's see, how long until that convoy gets up here? This is Charlie, second I see, uh, squad leader's currently I got some time. So... 2IC just stepped up for Charlie. It's good to hear that the 2ICs are stepping up. Normally they don't, and it becomes a bit of a mess. Uh, we're going to have this one led Squad lead by a BTR-60. Let's take for cars, I'm thinking, a limited Dishka Vic. Yeah, of course, we've changed plans a little bit. We're going to uh, more essential. And get let's get ride. another closed oh, Vic and load that with another squad. So I'm thinking... Another AT group would not hurt, so let's do tribal. Let's go to section AT. And the reason I do AT is because it has like, you know, it has a machine gunner, it has a UGL, it has a little bit of everything. So we're gonna set this guy to column formation. We're now gonna group all these VIX up back to back. And this BTR-60, because it's a slow vehicle, it'll start with a, um, it'll have a low speed. And that'll help the convoy. Oh, uh, bro, uh, Charlie to Alpha. This is Alpha for the front of the Thank Not you. Thank you. All right, convoy's still coming. Not up young. Not up young. Not up young. Jenny down. Jenny down. Jenny down. We'll sit that one up Charlie's over there. And that one I'm not going to set to careless hold fire. Yeah, if you could bring our makeup, that'd be great. Yep, I'll pull it in. Yeah, so this position engaged them was uh, the 50 cal that penned that convoy. I'm not sure if these guys will hear those shots. Oh, they might hear them in the distance. I just heard them as I was scrolling in. So, again, that's why I also like these op four points, because it creates little bullet traps for... Uh, these units and then I can have a squad of tribal fighters come down to try and retake it so again it's an AO where I get to basically have some dynamics to the AO and the players are kind of just in the middle so I'm gonna put this guy to the gunner's seat hopefully he'll shoot stuff and he decides to bail out instead 
So again, having some convoys go through. Still the BTR-60 is getting a little lead on that recovery a bit, but that's A-OK. -okay. And we've got one guy that's going to be able to run back and tell him. So after he gets back there, I'll have a squad coming because these guys aren't going to have radios, you know? And Galil, I think he's AFK, so they have him cable tied. We've got three things to recover right here. Roger, do you want us to load the things up and bring them back to the airfield? I don't think the closed transports can take the crates. They didn't bring any closed oh, transports. This is high. I'm going to read the following two things from what I told you to read at the beginning of the AO. Um, number two. C-130 can fit 18 pallets, and the recovery vehicles, the open flat top BIX, can fit pallets of materials. So the fact that we have both still at base is kind of concerning. We let both at base, so if there was mines and stuff on the road, they wouldn't go boom, because they're limited. Okay, then what? I guess Rex is gonna bring one up because who's gonna who's gonna bring it back? You know, like like I get it. They're they're using that as an excuse to claim they're being smart. That's fair, but if they actually had it, they'd have a guy in reserve, so they gotta send a squad now to go do it. But fine, if they're gonna they're gonna argue with the guy that made the mission, I'll just let them figure it out themselves. so we have to head back anyway, so we can all be able to move together and not have one It's all deja vu. Bravo to force. Send it. Uh, we're currently somewhere towards the middle of the map. We're scanning towns and complexes, and we're not seeing a whole lot of anything. Um, looks like it might be towards where you guys have been pushing. Well, it's probably going to be one of those missions where I don't read the feedback. Because <laughs> they didn't really bother to read how to do this one, so I'm not going to bother reading what they had to say about it. I don't know, again, I want to do all this varied stuff, but, you know, players don't... Bravo Echo message. Go, like, you know, it just, it's hard, it's hard. Uh, yes, I have VCOM Active Barb. I haven't played with any of the new features yet. I just have my old presets, because I haven't had a chance to play with VCOM just yet. Confirm jack shit and the villages to the east, southeast, and northeast. Be real Umbrella helpful worker. if they uh copy uh as of right now we're uh doing a bit of a maneuvering um but as of right now the uh town directly to the east of uh the bravo Again, marker, i'm, I'm gonna stop complaining about it but it'd be really helpful if they uh, the use the helicopter so looking pretty clear at this time uh we're moving to a position that's to okay them both just to verify before we step off back with you guys copy can you confirm your position or All where right, you're let's going see. to let's get uh, Bravo, stand by. Blue dot marked on map. Eyes on. I'm gonna have these guys stay here. I'm not gonna dynamically move any of them, but... Echo's gonna be to your southwest, and then pull up the dirt road to the west. That's okay. I mean... I'm gonna start prepping another convoy. Uh, just at least the vehicle. Let's see, it's 420, we still have an hour and 40 minutes, so I'm not rushed by anything just yet. Bravo to force, uh, who is in the, uh, the techie that's on the northeast of... I'll keep that Echo. there. Copy that, Echo. I get a frame drop. Yeah, I can see you guys. Let's well, open world, you know, they okay, gotta move at their own pace. This is Alpha Sunday. Do you want us to help hold this point and secure until you guys get the Vic up, or do you, or we get to move next, to the next point? Um, if you guys want to move, feel free to, um, I'll just kind of hold here until, uh, the flat Break, break, break. Um, uh, forces, be advised, this is Bravo. I've got eyes on a convoy with supplies moving from north to south, uh, along MSR from Green Circle Town. Be ready, be ready. 
So they got the uh, KPTV 14.5 millimeter down here. They got a 12.7 uh, right here. Echo, get the fuck out of there. Where's Echo's current location? Cool, Delta where are they? Where's the enemy? Echo's location. Oh, it's the BTR. I mean, that 14.5 and 12.7 should be able to make mincemeat of that 60 with its paper-thin armor, but... We Delta's can have bullshit if you want. Delta's moving into Echo's position. And Brad, I think, needs to re-verify his game 40? files. Are you coming in from the northeast? That's a big no. Uh, we're coming in from the northwest. Yeah, there you go. So after this one gets hit, I'll set up another convoy. I'll probably have it go straight north to south, uh, come up here, go around, do a convoluted route. These guys have pulled back right here. Bravo, what are we doing? Killing them or not? Now is the perfect time. Echo, if you want to hit it, hit it. See if I can get that vehicle to pull out. Yep. Pretty obvious, but uh, actually, it's badly damaged. Uh, trucks are escaping. Where's Echo? Uh, Probably he could right ram the fucking truck or something. Alright, so that vehicle is now pulling away because that was an obvious, you know, okay, if they're up there, just take the left turn. But we're going to have... I'm going to send uh, two technicals that way. So let's go to tribal fighters. Let's do cars. Since they haven't so scouted this area out, I can spawn these. whatever I want. If a squad could intercept it. Copy. Half of Bravo is going to intercept. We've got our machine gunner in the SPG truck chasing. And just because I know he's going to call that he's got someone behind him. Other half of my team's going to steal that land rover. Yeah, and then this guy, they were told that there was uh, something over there, so I'm going to spawn tribal fighter. Echo is disengaging from the firefight. Break, Bravo, you look like you have two men down. Correction, one man down up in the hill where you were before. Bravo copies. This is Delta, we're moving in to uh, assist. Oh! Nice to guys. Alright, uh, So, Shotgunner with the MG just, uh. Which squad just crashed the, uh, their vehicle? Cut that there. off. That's funny. <laughs> They're gonna need some wheels, but these technicals are gonna come up. Uh, and the SVG 9's facing the wrong way! We, uh, see possibly a checkpoint. Oh dear. Alpha copies we'll use that for future reference. Treat them fuel towns now. So Fabit's down, Thule's down. Still have Spartak infantry near the ambush site. I don't know how many are left though. Still duking that right here. Uh, one, two, five, zero. These guys have been engaging with that other group. Uh, that well, tank is still coming. Advised, uh, supply truck at current grid ref of uh, one, two, five. All right, zero, I'm gonna set up the next convoy. Nine, eight, three. That's going all right. Who? How are you doing? All right, so let's see. This one, uh, I don't want to have BMPs lead because they like to go off-road. 
Let's do a BRDM. Uh, BTR forty. Let's take the BRDM out. Actually, enemy factions fighting each other. We are not in contact at the time. Alpha copies. And let's do a full Ural. Open and put a squad in the back. Mark your position on the map. Delta Echo, be advised. I'm kind of gonna steal your spare yes. wheel. Yes. Yeah, we're gonna move our our marking now. Alpha, 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 Alpha stop. Alpha stop. Alpha stop. All right. I'm stealing your spare wheel, Delta. Delta. Don't worry about it. Alpha, be aware there is a BTR in the military base to your southeast. Cool. So now we've got two squads over here fighting with neutral factions. All of those tribal guys are down. These guys are not looking that way. I'm gonna say they're gonna call in some uh, reinforcements here. So let's see. Sounds like they're having trouble calling each other, which is not a good sign. Go for Delta. Are you guys the opposite hill from uh, where that BTR crash was? Do a Land Rover. Uh, I believe so, yes. Cool, did you guys steal the BTR 40? Uh, yeah, that's where we're currently in right now. At least I'm in. Right, I'm on foot with two other dudes. We're pushing southeast towards the rest of our squad. And jump it up. Confirmed. And then we'll have it turn around. So yeah, T-34 is coming in, and it's pretty mad. Let's go ahead, do some minor body cleanup back here. I think that's a spent AT-4 thing. Yep, that was to take out that uh, MTLB. And Havoc was able to get Thule and Fabit up, and they're still getting this uh, quote unquote lockdown. Hey, is that PKM working? That techie right in front of your BTR? Uh, I believe it's Echoes, but I think it is, yeah. Uh, it looks they're... like you guys just ripped all the tires off. Now. All right, sometimes that, uh, they, the forward bit goes, but the rest don't go, so you just gotta move them. He's supposed to be with me, so just hold on to him till we can regroup. So these guys are coming in on patrol. Oh, yeah. And we're hearing something heavy fire off. I think these guys are getting engaged by uh, 50 cal. Looks like they're towing it. So yeah, there's a tank now uh, going out and about. Red 4 QRF's coming in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, where are we moving to next? Yeah, so this I'm is Delta. a problem. Delta. So I'm gonna try relinking. Uh, Delta, if you wanna head south to the crossroads, we've got a pallet Charlie has a probably use to go back to base. The... We'll see how things go. Okay. Can you attach move orders to vehicles? Delta what do you mean by that? The, uh... How many languages do I know? Uh, two. And that Vic has gone completely off-road. Some AT just went off. These guys do the get out marker over here instead. And then see can destroy mark over here. 
But yeah, no, English and French, uh, and, um, autism, since I'm super duper dyslexic. Now uh, this BTR turning around and engaging. JY has been hit. These guys might not notice, though. An SPG-9 Vic would be really, really helpful. They're using all their AT on that really far-off tank, uh, though. To move towards the pellet truck and crossroads. And it looks like this convoy, even though it's doing some weird routing, it uh, seems to be working fine now. We also have a force holding the T-intersection itself, so... Charlie, this is Alpha, how copy? So, I mean, we do have a PKM truck that's gonna come up back here. Charlie, this is Alpha, how copy? Uh... This is Charlie. We are currently the southwest, actually, what the west side of the. I just realized the players have done a force split maneuver there. too, so that's a little concerning. Also, I don't think I ever set the global scale. Which, I mean, it's only going to affect accuracy, but with how many Che I have down, it's not going to affect too, too much. Delta, we're moving to the town in a DCR 40, moving towards the uh, crosshairs. Yeah, that guy didn't even fire. So, JY's still down, Ice just went down. Yeah, this six man team still maneuvering around up here. I don't know what they're trying to pull. Let's see if I have the magic touch. What would you say that is, 100 meters out? Let's aim a little high. That, I think, was just short. Yeah. It's just AI. Oh, so now that you use that AT, you don't... Ay, ay, ay. Let's range 150 meters and try. Also short. Do I have one for 200 meters? <laughs> World War II technicals when? When there's a mod that comes out for them, sure. Unless you mean I'm supposed to make them. In which case, I don't know, because World War II vehicle driving is very cancerous. Let's try 200 meters. That was high because this guy's wounded. Back northwest to the first helmet cleared as one of my guys is taking contacts there. Now that tank come in at a different angle. AT just came in, that's now cooking. And this guy, I think he's running all the way up to that position over there. And we just heard the BTR cook off. These guys still securing. That they're loading it in the Ron recovery, Vic. But, I mean, if you can load it on the other one, go ahead. Can't be here for long, though. It doesn't have wheels. Yeah, but... And once again... Yeah, I gotta baby this convoy. So just break them apart, watch them at every turn. It should be A-OK. -okay. Let's have these guys sweep around because they're eventually going to pull back. Hopefully, maybe. I don't know. We got these two guys down here. But if anything comes up, we're going to run away. Oh, there's no reason we're doing that. And these guys are getting shot at. And doing a dismount. But yeah, I mean, this group we told to move forever ago. VCOM and its maneuverability sometimes, man. It, it hurts. 
but we still have those people engaging. I am going to make another convoy. Just so much micro I have to do. These Vicks do not know how to drive. Where where are you going? I I don't know what he's doing. This is Echo. Are you guys already RTB with the truck with the supplies or are you still messing around with it? Uh, we are sending the truck back to base at this time. We're moving to. I honestly don't know. That's going to be our next. Uh, I guess he's tired of it. The garrison compound. We're going to go investigate. Copy the one to your southwest. All right, uh, tribal fighters. We'll do a Ural. I'll do Found some fuel crates. Somewhere. That's unfortunate. Sometimes the AI, man. Oh, would you look at that fucking QRF from our south? Uh, another uh, convoy. We have another truck with supplies to the south. Is that Echo just in contact? Confirm, make sure that's not us. This is Echo and confirm fucking towel heads everywhere. Shenita. Copy. Got me up. Got me up. Got me up. Secondary red box to your southeast or at least to uh, your markers. Yeah, so that one's gonna have a pretty easy pullback. Those guys are noticing that base. Charlie, this is Alpha. How copy? Sorry, was that a call for Charlie? It was indeed. Um, how are you guys doing, sir? Uh, we have about three men in the compound. We have six cargo containers mixed of mixed shit. I mean, sorry, nine, and uh, we're still under a bit of contact, and that tank is still on the MSR. Alpha copies, we're gonna move this just in a couple minutes from the marsh. Seek and destroy. Send in go team six now. Alright, Delta's gonna be moving to assist Echo. We are only a uh, three man team right now. Send in goat teams. So it looks like they're towing the partially destroyed one. Echo, what's your uh, current position? And Willow, thanks for the two gift subs. I hope you keep enjoying the operations and I hope you're getting a kick out of this. Uh, Delta looks like last echo marker was up on the hill to the east of our uh, original old position. And I'm going to uh, pull so this out of the AO. The, uh, gunfire. Because free vehicle. But he is too stupid to know how to use it. Just means if you don't hear from uh, Acura Delta that uh, you might want to expect a QR QRF uh, heading your way. Bro. Oh, because you're in the passenger seat. Jeez. He's AI, man. Now, hopefully, he'll start driving on his own. Yep. This is Echo. Any other squad around us, or it's just us? And this tank's Echo being super dumb. On the radio, you just need to get it from an accurate position. Like, I Copy don't know why it pushed the up road, there on its own. Adushka, if you can, come up the rear. But it did. Delta, or, uh, Echo, this is Delta, we're towards your, uh, west, we're up on top of the hill, we're gonna try to assist. Yeah, just to grab that guy's UGL and shoot. They're mainly engaged, uh, there's a supply truck mark on the map as well. Somebody could snatch that while we're engaging, that'd be great. Let's wake that tank up. You're stuck on a rock. Uh, 
Well, he's screwed because that thing's stuck. Man, the AI are not having it today. And that's very unfortunate. Delta has eyes on uh, that supply truck. Uh, Charlie to Alpha. All right, this, is this has made it out of there, so I'm gonna get rid uh, of we've it. We've taken care of the tank, and we believe we have secured the interior of the compound. Alpha cop is. He's AI Alpha man. They're funny. That's one. That's for sure. But let's uh, have Islamic State send a very uh, big response force. So the fact that their base is uh, getting looted. I doubt these AI are gonna even do this properly, but hey, you never know. I can, uh, I can be hopeful. Alpha, be aware, we are inside the compound. That guy's out of AT. Sorry, Alpha, what direction are you coming in? Yeah, so Caleb's driven up and uh, shot that guy dead, so. You're not on foot? No, we're off. Hey, that is enemy contact. That is not Alpha. Fucking kill it. That guy, because that tree is in the way, he's not seeing these guys up here and engaging, so. Set this guy as careless old fire, have him come back to this base. How did what? What did I hit? Did I shoot over him? Try this again. There we go. This is Echo to all Delta. If you're the only squad here, be advised we have a supply truck coming back to friendly. We're forces. gonna pretend that never happened. Hey, firm. We got eyes on. Wait for it. I'm gonna start using frag rounds. It's okay. Echo, uh, be advised it's okay. that the CR40 is on the move. Let's see what else happens. I'm, I'm liking this. We got, we got two of them. They, they hear it shooting. It's not just coming out of nowhere. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Scan that perimeter. Yep. Okay. Who else? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. Hi, I'm just just here. Yeah, in my uh in my sweet bachelor pad of uh of a crate. I'm just chilling. Anyone else? It's uh, that's three so far. Their squad's a six, so half their squad is mass cast. Charlie to Alpha. This is Alpha send it. Uh, is it okay that we kick off to the next town? Come on! Uh, feel free. Alpha. I want to get four. Hold this compound until the flatbed gets back, and we're also gonna head down to the. I gotta, I gotta uh, set up another convoy in a moment, but yeah, that's that's all okay, three of them. I'll go start securing that. Jeez, this is cheekier than I thought it would be. He's just Alpha there. He's just there vibing. The other three guys, they're um, walking around. So there goes Stool, and I think these two are gonna die too. So that's that's unfortunate. But it's time to start making another convoy. Yes, Stug tactic, something like that. I mean, Delta Echo. 
I don't know what to uh, say. I'm gonna try to take that uh, armed BTR-40 and be able to try to repair that and take that instead of the un unarmed BTR-40. I honestly don't know what to say with that. Echo copies. My squad was thinking of doing the same thing. They're gonna attempt oh. it to do it right now. Oh, fab we'll it. just get it back to base. If you want to follow us, we'll give it to Hold you. Hold up. Hey, Farm 4, loading back up an armed BTR-40. No, it's not one life, thankfully. Oop. There he is. He's eyeing it. He's like, what the hell? What's going on? <laughs> How are you alive, sir? He just, he just shrugged it off. He's like, nah, I'm not playing that game today. Just gonna walk it off. Okay. Sure. Why not, right? Just just let it happen. <laughs> Almost got four. I'm eyeing that position. I wanna see if we can kill more of them with that. I mean, just clear the compound, guys. It's I, I say stuff like that, but honestly I've never have you seen me do something like that before in a cargo crate? No. So they're not expecting that. That's why it's so confusing to them. Because, you know, I always throw curveballs at them until I throw them enough that it gets normalized. But if I do it if it's something brand new they don't know how to react to it. They can't like they can't comprehend it, you know? So that's why they're behaving like that. Oh, Sumbro. I hear him. He's teasing me. But for now, let's get this next convoy in. Hi, Command. Were there pilot slots? Or am I just fucking... As I said in the brief, any squad can take it. Hey, fam, I, I, I misread that. Take what? Today's been a busy day. I'm stealing the- I'm requisitioning the helicopter for Bravo. I will be doing reinserts for all squads, just hit me up on 50. I will also try and get recon. I said before I let them all on, hey, you have a helicopter today, please use it, but there's no Hello? dedicated pilot slot, so just have a squad take it. I hear you, Iceberg. Word, relay that I'm gonna be uh, using the helicopter for reinserts and recon for everyone. Iceberg is not going to be using the helicopter for reinserts and recon for everyone. Oh, then we can. Hey, firm. Hey, firm. Echo's RTB with a supply truck. All right, we got three of them, and they don't know where that AT is coming from. I don't think they're going to go uh, and stay in there, so... How unfortunate. So, another convoy coming in. Iceberg is uh, going in. He might try to uh, pick up his guys. They might try to act as QRF. There's quite a lot of supplies here, though. So we might see Mr. SPG chilling in his Vic uh, stay there for... Uh, a little while. And these guys, there was this Vic that they uh, have to uh, loot too, so. Otherwise, looking back. Looks like someone died on here. But yeah, they're getting that loaded in the C-130, so we've got about six, I think it's going to be about uh, 12... Uh, 10 or 12 by the end of it. And we got this convoy going through. That's a smaller one. Oh! He was in front of me. Oh! To base to rearm your four. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> we got four. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Four is the magic number. <laughs> this is 
They might be able to get Sunbro back up though, but yeah, that's... There's Dead Body 1, Dead Body 2, oh, Dead Body 3, and then Sunbro that's been, uh, he's dying right now, so someone needs to go save him. <laughs> oh, I can't believe that worked so well. Because I just meant for that to be, like, a good spot to overwatch things coming in, but... I think, I think Fabit will be able to save Sun despite that being an OG round. We can hope, right? now to hit some of that uh, roof. Uh, make that nine pallets. And you know what? I'm going to spawn some tribal fighters and send them in on foot because they're going to be there for a while. So we'll have like three squads go up. And then when they get closer, I'll uh, send in yeah, some uh, infantry, uh, some vehicles to assist. On the B marker, a transport truck to transport uh, pallets. All right, so that convoy is going through. That one's probably going to make it through. Iceberg might spot it though, or get shot at by the um, BRDM. And they've taken the SPG9. Oh, I guess Wait. we respond. Sunbro? Wait, why is Sunbro down? Uh, air to he got hit by the SPG. Uh, transport. I no. see a transport truck dead. headed away from the airfield with bricks. Since I can't hear Iceberg, I assume that's him in the helicopter. Can you hear me now? I heard him fine, but I don't know. Yeah, I stopped being able to hear you, Iceberg, which sucks. Alright, let's be a jerk with AT. Oh, uh, T4 Beta's pretty nice. Delta's on the way with, uh, to the house. Uh, Delta to which squad? Uh, Bravo. Copy that. I'm just gonna pop the scope just to make sure that you know that we're up. Hey, firm. Cool. So they're dealing with that position. Looks like the AI are trying to pull back. Maybe not. They're set to defend only. So, I mean, the squad leader, he's got, I, I don't know. Becom's weird. And those guys are starting to come in. So let's see. We're almost approaching the first hour mark, and they almost have one Vic, uh, one the plane filled with uh, stuff, so that's the wrong action. Does that go something just explore to the east of the base? Mm, that would be an IED. It would appear three of these pellets don't have uh, interact points. Can you pin your location? Ping. Alright, I'll replace them with ones that I know do work. That's weird because I copy and pasted all of them from the same three that started, so I don't know. Yeah, 
so that's a random IED going off just to represent a convoy that uh, got through. Except the driver is dumb and doesn't know how to drive. So you can just quickly replace the driver and all is okay. So I'm going to start building another convoy back here. First off, let's get these attached. I'm preferring to use the bricks because they're nice and visible. So let's go ahead get these things back attached. What? I wish we could select all the things we want to attach and then just do a single enter key. That would be something really, really nice to have in an update. Maybe if it ever happens. Probably won't, but hey, I can pretend because I know Achilles won't be getting an update anymore. It'd have to be in Zen, but Zen... Actually, Zen's pretty nice on its own. Ground forces, how copy? Um, so the... Hello, off to the east, I have marked up. There's a techie uh, and some other dudes at a gas station. And then way off to the east of that, there is a T-55 and some other shit chilling there. Uh, there are supplies back there. It's in a big-ass compound. Let's see. Let's do a PKM. No AT because there's a rocket Vic leading it. Hey, Alpha, is this Alpha or Delta? I'm right over. This is Alpha. Delta, are you on that? Send it for Delta. Am I right on top of you guys? Or I forgot to move Delta Mark now. Well, you guys don't have your U menu stuff set up, so I can't tell who's who. This is actual C-130, one space left. You guys will need to let me know if they're reinserts, by the way. Delta's leaving compound. We're gonna RCB to drop off these pallets. Alright, sorry I'm not speaking, I'm focusing on everything. Galil was part yeah, yeah. of Cause I need... that group. Charlie, Charlie, FL, FL, eh, SL is gonna be off net for a minute. Alpha copies. And that Vix made it. And once again, the convoy is not wanting to work. It's a little concerning. These guys still taking their sweet time, but I mean, these guys are also spending a lot of time. They're not getting some bricks. It's okay. If they miss them, they miss them. How are these guys doing back here? They're still trying to... They're still trying to pull those off. And they're also got the BRDM. Also, hi, uh, there's three more brick pellets. Are these supposed to be interactable or no? A firm. I don't know why they glitched out, but I'm going to fix them. It's really weird because they got one of the lines to work fine, but the other two weren't. I don't know. I don't know. Again, they all came from the same cluster, so... I can have you just spawn up at 130 when this one is full, or...? This is high, say again. Are you gonna spawn another C-130 when this one, one is full, or...? When it's full, you let me know. It'll take off, and another one will come in in a few minutes. Copy. Delta is RTB to drop off these ballots, so it should fill it up. It has one slot left, so... yeah. Yeah, we have six ballots. That sucks, we're sleeping back at base. We can load them Charlie, I'll back. back on net. I'll pick up this Charlie. Now we're gonna play the game of do I have enough runway? 
The answer is no, I probably don't. Caution. Yes, VCOM is enabled, Barb. I, I told you that when you asked the first time. Okay, I'll set it to Invincible. Also, I've got four debug ones here that'll fit 18. I guess I smacked the tail. I don't know. I raised it too hard. I don't know. Weird things happen. Echo to transport, Vic. Air to whoever has the transport, Vic. There's still three more pallets at Bravo's position that need to be brought out. How copy. Uh, pallet truck is full. We don't have space for any pallets All over right. RTB. Let's get cool. when you're another done, convoy you're to, to go come back. in I here. I have a convoy of more shit. We'll mark momentarily. Hey, I'm just mark on map and then we'll come and get in once we uh, drop these off. Thinking, let's see. Back to tribal fighters. Uh, we'll do a PKM. Type formation. Let's make sure it works. I'll look back in a second. Cool. All right. Charlie is on the way back to main base with pallets. Alpha Cop is recovering the town to the, to the, to the uh, northeast of military compound. Roger. These guys all dismounted because of the um, helicopter, so just something to be concerned about. All right, those Vicks are catching up. Someone just got ran over. There's still one left, cool. Iceberg, we've got a bunch of dudes shooting at them, so those guys aren't gonna be able to make it down, but they might be able to harass that one group. We'll see. It's on the slow end of things. That 1AT guy's walked all the way back, so good on him. And let's go ahead and delete some more bodies up here. Who stole Charlie's Vic? <laughs> I uh, had an Op4 guy steal it after they deployed from behind. And I believe this has a bunch of, yep, so that's six more. That should be fine. So I think this group might be going to try to get that convoy, even though this Vic is being super nice duper slow. Oh, that's good. But that's A-OK, -okay. and then this Vic has, um, I'm just gonna have him come Change down up. here. Ah, oh, yes, run over your own dudes. That, that's the way to win. Yep. So those guys have uh, pushed through that area. And I'm gonna have these guys pull back. Something just exploded. 
I don't know what that could have potentially been. And we have this convoy backing off as well. I don't know, they might um, be able to hear the convoy coming through up there though, so we'll see how that one plays. Delta to high. This is high, send message. Plane's full. Roger, please clear the plane so it can take off. Still up. Another one will arrive, and it'll be a few minutes after this one takes off. Caution, gear, down. Help it, brother. LA to Bravo. All right, Deuce features. Map marker, angry dudes. That's realistic enough for you, right? Uh, Central Baba. Are you at the convoy mark? Uh, we're past the convoy mark. Mark, uh, pushing uh, along the MSR northbound. Uh, we're doing an assessment again. We're encountering spread of computer. Firm, I'm following you. The convoy is one kilometer to your north. Clock up, we're continuing northbound on this road. Forces, this is high. First plane is taken off. Uh, next one will arrive in a few minutes. You can just keep the stuff here, and uh, when it comes, I will let you know. Mm, these guys. Yeah, I was, I was looking for you. Uh, to... I think they saw it, but yeah, that's another convoy going by. These guys are shooting up at him. Alpha, Bravo, all copy 15. Alpha copies. Bravo copies, we're currently trying to chase down a convoy. It's a good intercept uh, job. Take this to contact us, we're moving. And let's go over here and uh, get these bodies deleted. Echo copies, Alpha, Keep what's your the pause? server clean. Um, Alpha's currently south of Green Infantry B mark on the... This is Echo, see you again. Repeat last alpha. Oh, there you go. All right, cool. We have contact to our north, roughly ten squads. Delta to Bravo. Yeah, you guys are coming up here, engaging each other. I jumped. Can somebody uh, relay to Bravo asking them where they had the pallets last? So I asked them to pull back. These guys quickly tried to set up. Uh, pilot, the uh, supplies were still at the same place you picked them up last um, from Bravo. For some reason, it's marked Alpha Bravo pause. Hey, Get out of the AO. I want to see this rocket pick in action. And I'm bleeding. Yeah, no, we just saw that one engage up there.
So I'm gonna have that one turn around. And these guys are gonna go check out what all the fuss is about. Six. No. I'll let Sunbro get the kill. And that's made them dismount. So the bricks are still fine. And there's a cook-off round. I don't know what he's painting me over. But these guys will be able to come up and uh, assist. But that's going to allow for those guys to get up. And see what all of that is over there. These guys are loading up those. And... Oh, for the love of God, please leave. I don't want to have to try to land a C-130 on this. What the hell? Okay, you're now dumb, so... Ah, uh, stupid AI, man. They won't keep formation and convoy. That's why you don't see that many... Says hi, send message. Ground, ground forces. I heard hi to ground forces, which hey, wouldn't have made much forces. sense, but that's okay. Send it for Delta. This is Charlie, so. The green X way off to the northeast. Bravo intercepted a uh, convoy, and they have pallets that need to be picked up. Uh, they'll also need an extra vehicle for a ride as they uh, lost one of theirs. And job meet up. We're gonna have this guy come back. Alpha copy for two partisans. Try the copies, we're also too to far to assist. Less than half a click southeast of the main base, just mm -hmm. FYI, everyone. Well, this is gonna suck. Alright, can Liru land a plane? The answer is no, but the players are forcing me to try anyway. Set to invincible. And it doesn't want to fly. Okay. This is going to be the best landing in the history of landings. Except it didn't go the way I wanted it to. God damn it. Okay, well... Oh, this is gonna suck. Flaps down. I can't even line it up now. Oh god! I don't need to pull off Siri, I got it. Okay, flaps down. Echo hearing Bravo one by five. Although I made out very bad. Relay really for hurt. Bravo. Bravo said that they are a bit hurt and they're at that marker off the northeast. Echo hearing themselves. Random Conway southeast, standing still. I don't have an air brake.
Shut up, Siri! That worked? I mean, of course it worked! Of course it worked. Why wouldn't it have worked? So meanwhile, Kalem's group, um, they lost one of the KPTVs, unfortunately. These guys are in a compound on he uh, back here on their own because they went and tackled a convoy. This one, Vic, is going off on its own. So I think it's time to prep uh, another one. All, to all uh, friendly forces, we have a, a uh, vehicle out there that, that we should be able to repair with an engineer if you want it. So let's get some of these uh, yellow the bricks here. Nani? I have several questions. Are you telling me there's a script already in play for these things? Huh. Does it work for the other ones? I see. So, I'm an idiot is essentially the thing. Okay. Does it work for the brick? It does not appear to work for the brick. It... All right, the moral of the story is, um... I... <laughs> okay. And I could ace interact from it, so I'm just gonna do it that way. It's easier. My point is, I never thought to test that because that type of feature normally doesn't exist. So... It's weird. It's weird. That's all I'm gonna say about it. Alright. I believe all right. I saw a force headed towards you already. Let's get an AT guy to drive. He is in the I'm driver's sure seat. Time. Let me double check. Look, I'm just saying, uh, like, normally you don't... The, uh, like, with the normally that doesn't... That's not a thing, you know? Uh, Mr. Delta. I'm just saying, like, you can berate me all you want, guys, uh, but normally that's not, the, uh, like, you have to attach. Like, they, you can't actually load things in the VIX it. like that, so I don't know. It's weird. I think that's a vanilla feature. Maybe with Contact, because I remember Contact had some vehicles that could do it. I didn't know 3CB updated their VIX to do stuff like that. guys that are driving the vehicles are heading towards those car containers to grab them. Do you mind if I land in front of them and tell them to go that way? I mean, we're, we're only three strong. Ooh, I smell banana bread Bravo downstairs, is, too. Bravo apparently needs help, and you guys are the closest forces. Uh, be aware, be, uh, Bravo has a, Charlie, 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 <laughs> has a BDRM. So this is a tracked VIX, so it uh, might not work as effectively as we want. 40 and all that to help and Bravo, and down. the transfer truck can grab this ballast and bring back and come get me, and then I can help as well. 
Where do where do people need assistance? Because Charlie is at main base. If there's anything close that we can assist with. All right, so we're also gonna have the Islamic State guys start to encroach on that also, position. So let's see. Cargo for the AC-130. Islamic State. Let's get uh, an M2 Land Rover and an empty one. And get them loaded in this Vic. We're going to start putting uh, pressure on that Alamo position there. Have these groups also start coming up to do seek and destroy. Yeah, so they're, they're three CV V30, uh, VS3s, or V3Ss. So, yeah, I guess 3CB does have that feature, you know, the more you know. Uh, call sign that call if they need anybody need help. Yeah, uh, Echo got fucked. Shut the red bitch of the We're good now, but we need to be in another vehicle, I believe. We have a uh, BRDM we could take back to base. So all the forces are really split apart right now. Alright, let's go over here real quick, uh, take care of some bodies. Didn't mean to delete that tank wreck that I selected outside, but that's A-OK. -okay. Looks like they're also bringing that SPG-9 back with them as a little consolidation prize for the fact it killed four people. The mark that's on the opposite side of the map. Marker with a uh, vehicle. Echo to high. This is high, send message Echo. Copy, one of my guys unloaded a patient off uh, UAZ that's currently flipped right next to me and it flipped. I have fixed it. Yay. So we've got this group coming up. It's only two dudes though. Alamo is still uh, under heavy fire. I'm gonna basically just pedal to the metal this one, give him a nice uh, whole last stand thing here. And uh, as it goes on, I'll also send uh, maybe some light armor assets and stuff. Have this guy switch to the gunner seat. On there to uh, overwatch that position. Also debating sending the M2 up. That's a uh, guy on his own, so we'll go ahead and put those out. Maybe that Dishko will go out and try to extract them. I don't know what's wrong with this Vic, but it just does not want to drive, even when I took the driver out. This is Bravo, urgent. We need immediate support. We're currently being fucked. Uh, this is Pilot. Uh, it appears Alpha is currently fucked. There is a large convoy with MTLB and a very big supply truck here. Let's go ahead, trying to move that out. So because they're under contact. And pilot two all squads. Uh, it appears Alpha is getting their shit kicked in. 
Alpha's good, we want to warm up. Oh, well... What is the place I just landed at? There is a I think VCOM AI is just screwing with these. ...of dudes in an MTLB with two supply trucks. One just took off south, the other was still headed north. I don't want to have to manually drive them, but I will if they're going to keep being dumb. Alright, I think this is going to warrant the other T-34 to come in. We'll seek and destroy that, and then I'll also respawn the AGS, saying it got a second guy. That's the wrong AGS, it's the Hillis. Alright, cool. Wait, what's... <laughs> Bravo still at first. Ah, yes, the TSB artist uh, division. And those guys, they ran into the riverway, even though I put them up here to go down. So, I don't know. We're going to send a uh, BTR up from uh, this angle. Be advised, popping blue smoke on position. And I am going to also spawn another group of infantry, even yeah. though they're not going to get there because VCOM is too here, damn uh, slow. You guys, uh, currently, we're kind of hunkered down in the compound. We've got currently contact for us uh, southwest, south, and southeast. Hey, friend. I think that hit the wall. Blue smart marks our compound. Okay, firm. Still five flights out, but uh, we'll be there shortly. Be advised, bra be advised, Bravo and whoever else just showed up. Uh, contact coming in from the north, quad size element. Along the river. Alright, so he's getting me... I might have hit it, I don't know, but someone went down over there and we got this, uh... Oh, copy. Copy, right far here. north by the river. He just got hit by an RPG too. Friendly techie shooting at the helicopter. And his main rotor just took a heavy, uh, pretty bad hit. <laughs> just to take some pot shots. All right, BTR is going down. Those two supply vics are getting out of there. Cool. And there's the very angry AGS. Let's uh, ruin that position a little bit. Some more shots going in. And then we still have this group uh, over here sniping. I'm going to move that Vic up a little more. They've killed a lot of the infantry, though. you got to give them credit. And now you have this tank circling them. There's going to be a few KIAs out of that. Send in GOAT Team 6 now. All right, I am going to replace these guys. I'm going to break them apart. And I'm going to send them in on foot. Bob the Gaming Mermaid, I believe that is. Thanks so much for the sub at Tier 1. I hope you keep enjoying the operations, and I hope you're getting a kick out of this. Looks like they just tried to use uh, M72 against that technical. It did not work, though. And I'm also going to respawn this group. And send them in on foot, because the vehicle, it's the aircraft flying in circles that's uh, making that a bit tougher. All right, I'm gonna start bombing the heck out of this spot. Air to Bravo and whoever else is there. There's a BCR-60 coming in from your northwest. I'm just having him constantly engaged. That's turned that into a wreck. These guys are dismounting the tank, and that tank just blew up. All right, nice call there. 
I might have one more convoy get made. Right now they're really spaced out, and I don't want to send any more convoys here because we got one group uh, out and about over here. They still got four things to grab. We got this other one coming up. And it looks like support is coming. And that BTR again aggroed on the uh, little bird. But I believe there is a group of friendlies. No, they're sending a single recovery, Vic. Okay. I don't know, they just have all these guys back at base, you know? They're not really coordinating here. And where did my AGS Vic go? That got deflected. Because of course it did. And I'm throwing a grenade out there. Where did my techie go? That grenade launcher. I don't know. Oh, she's all the way over here. Some shots in there. I would say by now there would be some tribal QRF to also come in, especially with this guy running in. So we're going to put in some more tribal dudes. Let's go with. Let's go with two sections. From anyone. Central Bravo. Cali Bravo, do you need still need assistance? Uh, yeah, we're low, critically low. Nice, got sniped. And we're currently getting. Copy. Echo can maybe pick you up in TTFO. Now that thing push up a little more. Galil and Lance that are still up. And looks like most of these guys were taken out. BTR was taken out. And these guys have slowed. Little Bird could also be dropping in reinforcements should they choose. But let's see. I also, I don't want to send that. I'm not going to send that because there's no vehicle threat. Thought I had another technical in here that was a gun truck, but I think it already left on its own accord. Uh, what I can also do is I can send in a thing of tribal fighters. Again, I'm putting pressure on the southern group, and then I'm going to switch to putting pressure on the northern group. Because um, I'm trying to make it show them that, you know, doing these as a single squad is not the best idea. But, I mean, the difference is the southern group attacked a static position, and that's uh, going to trigger where, more response. Where do you guys need the most assistance at this time? At the Alamo. Compared to them just hitting a convoy and then the Red 4 guys checking Which out what happened there over there. Last I saw. Yeah, there's two Bravo. Alamo positions. Yeah, so that thing can take both squads. Bravo is Oscar Michael at BRDM from the West Blue Line. We have seven seats on the BRDM itself. Trying to no make up who they can. Crazy. If you want to get in, do that hole. Be advised, oh, I did see him. Of, uh, supply pallet that we could yeah, so I just fired where the AI was looking. I believe there's a family support truck coming in from the west, at least on seat. All right. We're going to have Op4 send in some pretty nasty stuff. This is pilot. I'm coming in with a quick QRF to drop off at the Alamo mark. And we're gonna do... It's a four-man team. We're gonna have these two things come in, because I said it's gonna slowly get bigger and bigger. Iceberg, he has... There's five slots in that big total, so he can transport groups of four. Delta to that one, Vic, I'm there's no reason to keep it. It's gonna just go out that side, so I can just delete it now. And this Vic does not want to go. Oh my god, can you, can you go? Oh my freaking... 
All right, we're gonna manual it. Oh, never mind. Transpire unload, and they're all dead. So that was a wipe. Northern position. Sending in the bigger stuff, it's gonna take them a while. It's cause uh, this is a limited position. Like, Red 4's main base was down here, Independence main base was over here, so they took out Red 4's base where I was going to coordinate stuff at, so. What I can do is claim that there is a squad in each of those Vicks and drop them off a bit earlier. And how we'll do that is like that. All right. Let's see. I need to also quickly check how full this uh, vehicle is. If I were to just do a quick cargo check. Because again, they need two of these full to win, so they've got six in there, and then if there's any extra... It only get it from benefits, though, if they fill an entire one up, at least for how I wrote next Thursday's mission. And then any vehicles they take, um, like what they keep, it's going to affect any more desert Bravo, missions Echo. they do. Echoes Oscar Mike with a BRDM, seven seats on the BRDM. I swear to God, you this are... Get in fast. I mean, since they're all dead, now it doesn't matter, but it's still annoying. Vicks are coming around. We still have some infantry back here. It looks like they got all of the things loaded in there. Now these guys have to figure out how they're going to get out of this AO. Pretty sure that could have taken people. And Bob giving out a gift sub and it lands hey, at Jokin Ad. I butchered that. I'm sorry I butchered there. that. <laughs> but I hope you uh, all keep enjoying Stop the ops. Hope you're staying safe on COVID-19. And I hope you're getting a kick out of this operation. All stations on this net. This is high. It will uh, hit the two hour limit in about 20 minutes. So I'm going to say 20 minutes. Uh, or in 20 minutes, start thinking about index. Over. Get in, Bravo. All right, let's make a super convoy. Yeah, so apparently when you move it, it rotates uh, the boxes, which is kind of weird. But that is okay. Let's have a super convoy. How are we going to make this alleged super convoy? Let's see. Let's have it led by a BTR-40, Dishka. I'm going to make this purely vehicle, so we're going to have a BRDM. Actually, even better, let's have it led by a BTR-60. That's a super slow Vic. And then as an extra deterrent, let's get a ZU Hilux into play here. So this will be a juicy target. We'll make sure that the uh, convoy is actually moving proper. And it's basically these guys are going to be making... Uh, making sure supplies get through on this one. And we'll have it cut through the center like so. I'm going to move this aside so the Vicks don't get scared when they try to move around. And looks like it's working. Cool. All right, with that all in play, uh, players have rescued the Northern Alamo position. Southern one got screwed. These guys are now moving down. They've Okay, they successfully were able to get out of that position. But the Southern one wasn't so lucky. Now, this position does have some uh, 
stuff up here. It's just a little tucked away, but it is there if they need it. I'm also going to start doing some body cleanup duty back here. Looks like there were some... Oh, that's unfortunate. Um, no, those were only spare wheels. Okay. And it's not too, too bad. Send in go they ditched six. this Vic because I guess they didn't have enough spare wheels. That's unfortunate. And they are just pulling back Send in accordingly. Six now. Donnie giving out five uh, gift subs. Thank you, Donnie. I hope you all still keep enjoying the op, staying safe from COVID. And I hope this was interesting. In I think overall six. I should have um, forced them to do an in-game brief. That should have uh, could have helped with the coordination, helped define their assets. Because I'm just trying to put everything out there so I can start setting up things while they set up things, but I think they need the extra hand holding. So meanwhile, these guys have come back to the exact same position to grab some of their gear back. Oh man, this right, I'm just gonna put out the T-55. And that convoy is going to push by. Here's what I'm going to have to do. Careless hold fire, so they pushed by unmolested because they've already had an issue. This is. Hi, send a message. Can we have a tally on how many um, pallets of supplies we got? I think there we have a full one, and then there's six more slots in the chopper. Hey, uh, Charlie, the convoy. It's not really a convoy, but yeah. Uh, you guys have a convoy. Here? If you're behind a truck, you know, you see all 40, that's Delta, and they're just driving back to base. Not I'm just really firing out where I see people. Roger. Oh, this is going to be a rude awakening. Vehicle, uh, AT just came in. That sounded like a good hit on that BTR. That was the plan. Yeah, Delta's top speed is 60. And the Vicks are freaking the fuck out. It's going to be a long convoy. All right, he he was healing himself, but I think these guys are gonna start picking up their own dudes. A lot of tribal fighters just came out. They're gonna start going over there. I'm putting some GL rounds at where I saw a dude. And I might have just killed my own buddy right there. That's okay. It happens. It's Durka Durkistan. You never know what might happen. And I'm going to just replace this guy because he's going super duper slow. And hopefully now he'll catch up. Throw grenades in here. I, I haven't heard these guys check in on radio at all, so. Shock infantry. Mr. GL, you got one more box of things. What are we going to do with them? And is that T-55 coming, or is it, uh... It pulled into the compound and got stuck on the perimeter wall. What a chad. Okay, let's replace him, and maybe he'll, uh... 
act appropriately. Just get the Alright, so BMP is going on its own little adventure tracking. And let's again check the cargo here. Still six left. They haven't really been uh, getting anything this uh, second hour. It's because they broke off, stopped talking with each other, and it all got very, very messy. BRDM kept stopping. I'm having it adjust. That convoy's moving super slow around. And what do we got loaded in here? Uh, four of those, one spare wheel, so they might still be too short. Just gonna mean there's gonna be, uh, in a future op, it's gonna be a little harder, but that's a okay. And you literally pointed your gun the opposite direction. Gotta love the AI. No, it's not the- it's not an SCP mission. This is the- I mean, it's- yeah. You know what I mean. And I just died because the engine got too hot and killed me. Tonk is almost here. Karn is pulling back with three things. So as long as he can get back, he should be A-OK. -okay. And looks like the Vic is adjusting. I think it's breaking off. Alright, we're gonna be mean. can't move up that direction because I'm just gonna run into the, uh... <laughs> I paused for a second to line him up and he pulled left. Alright, so... Onion's down, Rex is getting shot to shit. Back in black, he does have time to possibly do medical, but... Yeah, with Rex down, I mean, no one, they haven't called on 50 at all, so I, I don't know why they, you know, are going up there on their own. I know it's open world, but again, if you go up to places on your own, you're going to get screwed. Why are you... I don't know, Karn looks like he's avoided this uh, patrol here, driving, not patrol, but he's driven uh, in between. And these two Vicks, I'm honestly just going to retie to the convoy because they keep glitching out. Is that an HE shell in that building? Yeah. Might as hell. Yeah, they're shooting at him and he's glitching out, so. Do an HE frag. We'll put it in the window right there. The building right next to him, Back in Black, was able to get Lance up, and I'm still not hearing anything on 5-0. Okay, here's what we're gonna do with Lance. I'm gonna spawn Lance. 
we're gonna attach Lance. Or this is Rex, excuse me. So we're gonna attach Rex to a different Rex. We're gonna put Rex out there. Hey, you good? This is hi, send again over. I think we, we good. Done? Everything's loaded. All right. Well, there's still people out doing stuff in the AO. All right. But is the thing full? Not Negative. full. I think two slots left. Uh, three squads out there. There are three left. Well, Echoes SL is DCing. Yeah. So they are falling back with their lives. And Karn is still coming up, so... Is there anybody on net that's still out there? One of them does have an LR, and they've gone to the same exact position and been mass cast twice. They just haven't said anything, so I don't know what to tell you guys, but... Last Vic is coming in oh. with uh, three, and uh, that should be enough. So if you guys are waiting around at base, you want to DC, feel free. Uh, when they get back, we'll uh, I'll end X the server. I know exactly where they are. Oh! 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 oh that's gotta suck. Disregard some of. So they still have one Vic coming up, but the guys that survived, um, they ran into the rear of a super convoy and got kablattled. So they're dead? Yes. So, index? Yep. Curef's on the way. No! You're gonna fly right into a ZU, so I'm gonna save you. I'm not gonna write any worky comments. No. Time for an upgrade. Doesn't matter what you have, ending. it's gonna take it all. Alright, so, uh, overall... Thought that went really, uh, pretty well for All Things Considered. Uh, let's see... Taking out my notes here. Uh, first half, you guys kind of bumbled around. I really implied to use the helicopter, but you didn't. Still went to uh, static positions, used your intuition, went to a fuel station, got some stuff. Uh, there was a convoy coming up, but it got engaged by another force. Uh, I think some of you heard the gunshots and went south. You found the main Red 4 HQ position, took that out, got some supplies. Uh, then uh, there was a central position owned by Green 4. You guys took that, got some supplies. Just a reminder, guys, make sure you fully clear a bla uh, place out. Uh, if you hear an explosion and uh, see that a buddy goes down, maybe not run up to him. I uh, daisy-chained four of you with an SPG-9 in a crate. And uh, I thought that was kind of funny. But, uh, you know, just make sure you're clearing things out. If you hear something nearby, make sure you check things because this community, people like to... Uh, run up to bodies without thinking and uh i just get to poop them too but other way uh iceberg then got in the helicopter uh we saw some more convoys get hit which was pretty cool uh two alamo positions happened at the same time one in the north for a convoy and the one on the south for a fuel station uh unfortunately for the fuel station one they got wiped they went back they got nearly wiped again uh, because uh, the mansion area which was to the far right was the green 4 hq and they were sending a lot of their units there and overall, you just barely, after that last vehicle Karn was bringing up, that would have had the last three things to get to um, planefuls of uh, supplies. So missions will proceed for next Thursday, or at least uh, where I want this campaign to go. So uh, good job. Now let's uh, debrief squad by squad. All right, so Alpha. Um, Alpha, you guys did great. You guys did everything I would expect from you. Um, I had full trust in you the whole time. Um... We start off by heading south with Charlie. We cleared first town. We then sent one of our guys back to pick up um, a flatbed to bring down because we didn't want to bring it down if there was IDs and stuff on the road. Um, cleared that. We picked that up. Charlie then moved ahead, um, started to engage the military compound. I tried to talk to you a couple times, Charlie. It was kind of, it was on and off. Like sometimes you would respond, sometimes you wouldn't. But it's fine. Towards the end, you started to pick up a bit more. 
Um, we took a military compound with Charlie, um, cleared the checkpoint that we had a bunch of VIX there. Charlie then RTB'd with all of the VIX that we had spare, while Alpha moved into the town to the east. And we were assuming that Charlie would come back to assist us with pushing more to the south. We carried on pushing, clearing compounds. We then started to, you know, feel like, hey, where's Charlie? But we're, oh well, I guess they're moved on up north elsewhere. So we carry on. We check map, see that there's a marker for some infantry, some bad men, sorry, angry men, and one techie at a gas station. We then think, all right, that should be simple. It'll probably have fuel. We can go there, kill the techie, kill the infantry, quickly grab it and dip. We go there and turns out there's like a platoon sized um, element of infantry plus like GMG, tacky, and armored fix. I expected the tank to come that came from the east as it was marked on the map, but the platoon sized element of infantry we didn't expect, which we ended up nearly wiping them all. We then got wiped to a GMG um, tacky that we couldn't find until the end, and then got wiped by RC. We then went back, um, found out there was two more squads there of infantry that we were pretty sure wasn't there when we left. But yeah, I don't have any African ops um, planned. And then no. pretty much got wiped again to just RC. But aside from that, yeah, it was fun. No complaints for Alpha. Um, bravo. Um, bravo did a little bit of twofold. Um, we initially were going to do start uh, just kind of booping around doing recon. Uh, quickly found out that wasn't going to be the best case scenario here. So we uh, moved towards the middle of the map and then got eyes on a convoy. Uh, hit that, uh, recovered the supplies there, then pushed south to a secondary compound where there was a bunch of supplies kind of in a compound, which is where we got SPG'd in the back. Um, to be completely fair, I thought that was an RPG gunner uh, somewhere outside the compound to the south there, uh, which is why I walked up the way I did. But anywho... Uh, that happened. Uh, some of us died in that regard, and we got uh, when we reinserted, we brought the helicopter up online and uh, reinserted. Uh, from there, we loaded the, uh, those supplies there. Uh, we got off in the SPG technical and a off-road, and we moved to engage a third convoy, excuse me, a second convoy, out to the far east. Uh, chased that pretty much all the way up to the northern section of the active map. Uh, we eventually uh, knocked out the vehicle. Uh, at that point, we were uh, hurt, so we bunkered up in the Alamo site and fought off a bunch of stuff from a bunch of different directions. Um, eventually had to run out to go get bullets, but uh, yeah, and by the time everyone finally came up, we kind of dealt with everything. So again, sorry for about that, but uh, the, the the danger was over by primarily by that point. Um, yeah, we Alamo'd and we went back to base. That's about it. Bravo, you did fantastic. Uh, Charlie went south with Alpha t all the way down to the uh, military base, which we cleared. Then we took vehicles back up to main base. By the time we got our vehicles up to main base, there was a need for assistance pretty close to main base, which we assisted, grabbed more vehicles, brought them back. We fully did intend to go back to Alpha, but it just never happened. And then the second time we got vehicles back, we took a helicopter ride to Bravo. By that time, we were not needed. So we just helped bring vehicles back, and it was Index. Uh, Charlie did very well. Good job, you guys. All right. Delta kind of started as a uh, recon squad. We were uh, kind of helping to scout out and all that, but uh, we ended up losing two or three people and kind of just turned into the logic crew and kind of just were playing convoy of grabbing supplies and bringing them back to base. And then we ended up uh, getting tasked to help out the Alamo, like quite a few other people did. And then we kind of brought back those crates from there and then it got indexed. Besides that, uh, Delta did pretty good for uh, our small little group. Air, I guess. <laughs> all right, that's all the squads. Overall, I can't wait to get bashed in the uh, reviews because uh, no one was there to hold their hand because I'm trying to make them hold their own hands. But thank you so much for watching. Go operate operationally. Enjoy the rest of your day or night. Cheers.
and have a good one. We'll be back in four hours on the ground for the TMTM operation, unless I pass out. <laughs>